Hey guys, Mata here, and we're going to discuss everything free-to-play related in this week's Modcast Q&A. Happy Thanksgiving, everybody. This week's Q&A features Senior Community Manager Maud Iaza, Content Developer Arcane, and Lead Content Developer Karen. Karen mentioned he's been involved with some interviews for some new recruits. It's great to hear the Old school RS team is getting even bigger. Back in September, Maude Karen said they're looking to increase the dev team by at least 20 more staff members. Product director Mike D said the games he used to work on usually use 20% of their revenue into the dev team, but the old school team is in the single digits right now. Hopefully we look forward to having the old school team double by 2021. Karen brought up plans for dealing with the dual arena in the future, possibly limiting how often players could go there, maybe even a death cap. There's a lot of thought going into this, so we'll see how it affects us later on. Someone asked the developers about their thoughts on community Ice Giant Boss suggestions. Karen said he saw many different Ice Giant Boss suggestions, but he didn't have one to talk about in mind. However, Maud Aiza asked about their thoughts on expanding the Giant Boss series. Karen mentioned when he looked back at the development of the Hill Giant Boss, Orbor, and the Moss Giant Boss, Bryophyta, he believed there were some mistakes. He basically said the bosses were too difficult for the level of monster they were locked behind. The bosses were supposed to be good money makers for free to play. New players would probably be level 80 by the time they're ready to fight them, but they would be members by then, so they're missing the window to actually face them in free to play. He also said you basically need best in slot free to play gear to have a chance at them and that the key rates are high so you don't kill them as often. Karen isn't against reworking the hill giant boss and the moss giant boss if it can help newer players earn a bond. Mod Iaza also suggested offering a new boss if they choose to rework the older ones. So what are your thoughts on this? Do you believe these bosses should be reworked? If so, how? You can write your thoughts in the comments. The Moss Giant boss can only poison you in memory worlds. Maybe if she received a rework, the anti-poison potion would have a use in free-to-play worlds. In my opinion, since we already have bosses with their level of difficulty, we shouldn't completely get rid of it. As long as we can get a boss or two that can replace their level of difficulty, that the hill giant and moss giant bosses provided then i'm okay with them being reworked however what kind of semi challenging bosses would you guys want in their place it was an interesting qa stream this week until next time good luck have fun peace Mm-hmm.